I'm just about to set up a new session here. Got the players arriving in about 10 minutes. So this is the perfect time to load the players up into the system and get it ready for when they arrive. And we're going to assume a couple of little things here. We're going to assume that the venue is already up and running. You know what you're doing. The pitch vision has been set up there before. And we're also going to assume that you have your players already set up in the system. If you're not sure on either of those factors, then we'll be doing some other videos on those another time. And you can check out the link to those in the notes. But let's talk about setting up a session. Remember, we're just about to have some players arrive. So it's very simple, very quick. You go into setup go into session management and then you click on new this allows you to create the session that's just coming up you can call it anything you like but in my case I'm going to call it the name of the venue which is WOS and then the date as I say you can do it anything you like you don't have to do that but that makes it easy for me for reference when I'm going back over old sessions you then choose your venue from the list of venues. And as you can see here, we've already got a few set up. So we're going to choose the indoor one. And then we're going to have our options for what's going to be happening during the session. So in a normal net situation, you'll have a few bowlers, three or four bowlers, say, and a batsman. So we're going to tick the batsman there. Don't always have a batsman in, so you won't always tick it. It will also ask if you're tracking shots. We're not tracking shots here. And we're also using pitch vision, but we won't use the video only mode, which literally just uses the video and doesn't have pitch vision. It doesn't even need pitch to be there. There's no bowling machine in this session, but if you had one, you would tick that box. Once you've got that set up in the way that you want it to be that matches the session, you pick out a couple of players. You can either search using the search box by the name of the player, or you can just click on the player and add them in. So let's add in a few players doesn't matter whether they're batsmen or bowlers or whether they're going to spin around, alternate, do anything like that. You just throw them all in there. Once you've done that, you save the session. It saves the session. You close the window. You're then up and running. And you can do that, as you've seen there, within a couple of minutes. Ready. Contact our sales team if you want to find out more about Pitch Vision as either a permanent or a portable installation at your cricket coaching centre.